Hey everybody, welcome to Heat My Shorts. I hope you're all doing well today. Before we get going, I just want to wish two friends happy birthdays. Brent A. in Brisbane, Queensland, Australia. Happy birthday to you. And also Nikki B. in Kelowna, BC, Canada. Happy birthday to you. Hope you both have an awesome day today and a happy birthday. And happy birthday to anybody celebrating a birthday today. And to the rest of us, have a great day. Happy unbirthday. So, it's Tincture Thursday today. I'm up a little early today again. Actually, I've been up for a little while, about an hour. I've been up since about 5 a.m. And, uh, yeah, had some coffee, had a piece of toast. And I think we're going to do a tincture review. I don't, I don't know why I said that, like it's a surprise. <laughs> um, today we're going to be reviewing, by request, the Four Horsemen of Doom X Caramel Swirl from Late for Work. This one was actually quite a ways back in our review lineup, but we had some requests asking us to review this one. So we're going to do that. It's got a really awesome label. There we go. There's the, the four horsemen riders right there. Riding towards a nuclear explosion. And you can see the caramel swirl right in the middle there too. Uh, so I'll tell you a little bit about this. This is quite the tincture, to say the least. <laughs> um, so is what they've done here. They took the original Doomsday tincture, which is Reaper, Scorpion, and Ghost Peppers, soaked for three months and evaporated for four months. Then they mixed it with a Dragon's Breath soaked pepper tincture. Uh, then Mount Doom X was added after its six month soak and two week evaporate. Um, the soak is the, the, the alcohol soaking with the pepper powder and the evaporate is the, the evaporating process where you let some of the al alcohol evaporate off of it. Um, where were we? Mount Doom was added after its six month soak and two week evaporate. Caramel flavor was also added at this point. So, that's some of the hottest tinctures I've ever tried right there. All mixed together and evaporated for longer. Um, from what I understand, the longer that they soak, the stronger they get, and the longer that eva it evaporates, the smoother and the stronger it gets, I guess. I've never made tincture, so I don't really know. I'd love to try it someday, but I don't really know for now. <laughs> um, my arm's getting tired from holding it up like that. It's early. <laughs> so, if you remember, I did the... What was it called now? Sorry, the Sergeant Dunn and Late for Work Doomsday Tincture. Not too long ago, maybe just over a week ago. I did a full Robbie of that in the bigger bottle. This is a smaller bottle. I'm not doing a full Robbie this morning either, but I'm going to give you an honest review of this stuff. Now you can see it's got a little bit of, oh, it's got, a, got some fingerprints on the bottle. Wipe those off so you can see a little bit better, better idea of the clarity. It's quite clear, a little bit of murky cloudiness going on in there for sure. But I mean, the amount of peppers and the evaporating and maybe even the caramel, I'm not sure. But it's definitely a decently clear tincture. So let's open it up. See if we can actually even smell any caramel swirl on it. Or I guess you don't smell the swirl, but it's a part of the name. <laughs> oh wow, okay. That's like all I'm smelling is caramel. Wow, that smells really good. That smells too good. Oh wow. Okay. <laughs> I wasn't expecting it to smell that good. I was expecting maybe like a hint of caramel, but I'm not even really smelling peppers, which is kind of scary. I'm smelling caramel. So I'll show you in the dropper. Oh. See in there, it looks fairly clear for sure. It looks very nice. Nice light golden brown color. Let's give it a try, shall we? So. I'm not sure if this is classified as a 
Sergeant Dunn and late for work tinctures. Definitely late for work. I guess, I mean, Doomsday went into it, so I'm not really sure, but I'll say it from late for work and Sergeant Dunn. This is Force Horseman, sorry, not the Force, the Four Horsemen of Doom X Caramel Swirl. Heat my shorts. It's delicious. It's hot. Ooh, I can feel that in my teeth. I give it a little bit of a swish there, not a lot. Oh yeah, that's hot. That's really hot. Great flavor. I definitely got that caramel flavor right away, but the pepper flavor crept in very quickly. And now I'm kind of tasting that Mountain Doom savory kind of flavor. That's hot. Um, put me to an instant 4 out of 10 and it's climbing. Um, all over the mouth and the throat. It's really going for the throat right now. Surprising for not even being a Robbie or anything like that. Not really even pushing the dropper size. That was an honest squeeze. I'm at a hmm, five or a six out of ten now. Yeah. Wow, that's really hot. That smell is deceiving. The the scent is deceiving. Wow. It's smooth, but it's pepper flavored. It's savory and it's sweet. I think that put me to a six out of ten. Yeah. That's warm. Considering there's, as far as I know, no cap crystals in that. That's the hottest nat natural tincture, maybe. Is that, yeah, that might be the hottest natural tincture I've ever tried. I may have to try it with some, like, um, compare it with some other ones. I might get some, some tears going here. Impressive. Definitely quite a bit of sweat. Quite a bit. <laughs> I guess I should give that a flavor rating. Um, hmm. I don't know. I want to say 10 out of 10, honestly. Aside from the burn that's going on, the flavor alone, yeah, I think that's a 10 out of 10. Delicious caramel flavor, and even great pepper flavor, and um, yeah, the Mountain Doom kind of aftertaste. Actually, no, it's not an aftertaste of Mountain Doom. It's a mid-taste, because the aftertaste is caramel again right now. See those tears? I don't know. Definitely see that shiny face. <laughs> That's got a serious heat to it. I am glad that I did not do a Robbie of that. That would have made for a rough morning. <laughs> but you know what? This stuff is great. I really like it. Um. Not really too much else to talk about on here, uh, other than 
I would absolutely recommend it. If you want a hot tincture, like very hot, and a delicious caramel flavor, this is a good one. But having said that, I don't think you can restock on this one because I think it's sold out now. They do have the, uh, the non-caramel swirl version of this. It's just called the Four Horsemen of Doom X. <laughs> it's trying to take my words from me there even. It's really going for the throat. And they also have Mount Doom X on the website, as well as so much other stuff. Um, LateForWorkYouTube.com They have a Harry Potter series they've just released and a Nightmare Before Christmas tincture series. Definitely want to hit those up. They all sound so good. This one's really got me sweating. A little bit of tears for sure. Oh, there's a little doggy over there. Oh, she's just out of view, unfortunately, so we will have to... Actually, you know what? Maybe I'll just bring the camera over. That seems easier. Let's do that. <laughs> oh, yeah, look at that. <laughs> Definitely. Here's this little doggy. Here's this little doggy. Oh, pardon me. Making some weird gurgle sounds there. <laughs> oh. Are you a good girl, Maggie? Are you a good girl? Yeah. Yeah. What a good girl. She's a good dog. <laughs> Hopefully do this without dropping the camera. I'm sure that'll happen one day. And fasten it back onto the tripod. Oh, there's another little tear there. <laughs> this is really good stuff. Great job, Jason. And Floyd, I'm not sure. But either way, whoever had a part in that, great job. Um, I don't really have anything else to talk about here. But I have thoroughly enjoyed this little short burn session, a little bit of a shorter video today, I guess. That's all right. In this corner, you'll see our Heat My Shorts logo. Make sure you click that. Click subscribe if you haven't already. In this corner, Late For Works channel, uh, Kim and Jason's YouTube channel. Hop over there, give them a subscribe if you haven't already. Up here, Sergeant Dunn's YouTube channel. Give him a subscribe too, for sure. Up here, a playlist for you to enjoy. Hope you all have a great day. I love you all very much. We will hang out again soon, I promise. This has been Heat My Shorts with Maggie and Steve. The Maggie Show. Bye-bye.